We're at Coeur d'Alene Airport, Airport uh, Pappy Boynton Field. Um, we got a bunch of wind out here. I hate watching videos with wind. Unfortunately, I don't have the equipment to block out the wind. So I'm going to flex my rights around here. I'm trying not to narrate too much in the wind. So you probably turn the volume down. Or I may edit it out. Edit it out. I'm having a problem talking today. Uh, so let's take a look. Now I think this is a public airport, man. <laughs> So I really didn't do any research on this, so if they ask me to leave, I'm leaving Saturday. I feel kind of confident. I usually don't do this on the weekend. I'm going to be very careful. So actually, the airport's actually in Hayden Lake, Hayden, Idaho. But it's called the Coeur d'Alene Airport. Flag, folks. So Pappy was a Marine. Sounds like. Good, how are you? Good. Hi, I had some questions. Um, do you, is this a, is this a, a public airport? Uh, yes, it belongs to the county. Okay. And then, um, so am, am I allowed to walk out there and, and take pictures? Unfortunately, no. No? Mm -hmm. Okay, um, what about upstairs? Am I allowed to go up there? That actually belongs to a flying service. They're renting that okay. out, so I believe they would like to keep it private. So they rent the, the upstairs? Yeah. The flight school? Yep. Okay. And so could a person uh, come here and, and talk to you and say, hey, I'd like to get a flight to, to Spokane or something? Uh, we don't charter flights. We just take care of the, the private aircraft that come in. Okay. So this is all private aircraft that come in? Uh, yeah, the jets are. Okay. They're privately owned by either a charter company. So what about the, uh, so the, they have Forest Service has a uh, airplanes that come in, right? Mm -hmm. And then how about the Marine Corps? You've got a Marine Corps flag out there. Is that just honoring Pappy? 
Yeah, that's just for Pappy. Okay, so there's no Marine Corps uh, 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 station here or anything? No. Okay. All right, what's your name? Katie. Thank you, Katie. Yep. Now, I could start taking pictures of these people's private vehicles, but I ain't, oh man, I ain't trying to provoke them. It looks like it's a non-event here. They seem to respect my rights, and uh, so I'm just going to. I do like checking out the license plate, so that one says Freight OG, I think, or Freight, Freight Dog, Freight Dog, I Dog Sky, see, I, I'd love to go around and do that, but I, I man, maybe. Let's sit back here in this cubby walls. See what's going on. to go up in that thing. Anybody knows what these planes are, leave a comment. Well, he got to drive back there. I'll just be able to walk back there and take some pictures. I'd love to be able to look inside that airplane there. I know somebody's private plane. I wonder what it's like inside. Wi Fi. What's going on, bud? I didn't do it. Are you gonna fly that thing? Huh? You fly that? Yeah. Really? Yeah. How fast can it go? Uh, 0.78 Mach is what you know is the max. We usually go on live legs about 0.74. So over the ground, it can differ. If the wind's pushing versus blowing. Are you like always flying that same plane? Uh, this one now, yeah. I came from the airlines, you know, after the COVID, came back to doing this. Airliner's a little quicker, but this one's a lot more fun. So. Man, you're a lucky guy. Yeah. I've that sounds like a blast, man. I've had Heck way yeah. Worse jobs. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I didn't know if you were out here for a bank, like repoing airplanes or what, because I almost got into doing that for some, some guys, you know. Right. Know where an is, right. Like, you know? Yeah, that's not me, man. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll be out of here probably. Hey, if you could, man, I'd like to get some pictures of the inside of that. I just got a YouTube channel. That's all I'm doing out here, man. Yeah, the company's pretty private. Okay, yeah, I hear you. Flexjet, so they've got a pretty strict policy on that 
Doesn't hurt to ask, though. Yeah. Sorry, man. Thanks, bud. There it is, man. He's flying that dude around. I wish he had more time. I'd love to ask him where he's been, the sights he's seen. I bet you he's seen some stuff. A youngster, man. Looks like they're, uh, I wonder if they're just grounding that plane. I think that's just the ground. Static. Well, I actually don't want to get trespassed out of here because I may want to uh, come back and take some flying lessons. How's it going? Hey, how you doing? Mind if I take a look in the door? Yeah, what are you after? I'm just looking around. Just okay. uh, trying to take a picture of cool stuff. Yeah, well you're welcome to walk up and down the gate. Can I look in that door? Uh, I mean, I can do it, but I'm just asking out of courtesy. Just want to look inside, see what's in there. Is that like where they teach the schools or what? Uh -uh. No, it's just private hangar stuff. Okay, just like equipment? Yeah. Okay, all right. Where do they, do, or do you work here? Nope. Okay, so you're just like a customer. I'm a, I'm a contractor. I work on their stuff. Oh, okay. Right on. All right, appreciate you, bud. Oh, this little hanger. No. Fuma Blanca. All right, man. I don't know where the classes are. It must be upstairs right here. I was gonna be I was gonna get a paraglider man, but I'm getting too big now and old. I wanted to get me one and fly around. But you know ever since I fell, I actually got I'm afraid of heights now. It's weird. Look down, it looks different now. Looks like death. All right, folks, so I'm done here, and uh, I will take a hike, which is what they want me to do anyway. I might hang out a little bit. You know what? I think they call the cops. I smell tyranny in there. I said, I fly that, man.
one of the old up plants. Look at him. He's getting nervous, man. He says somebody might repo my plane. bathroom in there and everything. You know they do. Hey, anybody know how far that can go? I wonder how far that can go. I think you can make it to like California. Yeah, I want to go for a ride, man. I would love to go for a ride in this jet.
Let's see. Do you want this drink? All right, looks like this is a skydiving uh, outfit. And uh, I think, are you people waiting to go skydiving? Well, we're, we're, we're done. Oh, you you went skydiving today? Yeah. Two, earlier two on. Two of them. Oh, we're at 50% rate. <laughs> really? Yeah, because, of the because of the clouds? Yeah. And you went up in a jet? Yeah, this one right here jumped that, out of the uh, <laughs> No way. No, that's, we went up. We went okay, that's what I that's, thought, man. But that's how we got here. <laughs> oh. Really, from where? Uh, yeah, Cleveland. right. <laughs> so you flew in from Cleveland on that? Yeah. How did you get here? I, I just walked up here. I parked down the street. Oh. With, uh, no, I'm just I not. that's one way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> so so I'm, I'm interested in this. Uh, so, so you. Did, were you able to make it all the way from Cleveland on that without stopping for gas? Uh, well, it's, it's Jet A fuel we put in there. Okay, but so you were just without stopping all the way from Cleveland oh, to yeah. here? Wow. Are you one of the instructors? No. Are you just a skydiver? No, I'm just, uh, I retired a few years ago. Okay. So they've been skydiving already today, and then they canceled off the rest. You heard all that. And that's the one they're jumping out of over there. And I think that's the one I saw come in. One of them come in. Maybe the last one. So that thing come from Cleveland nonstop to Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. There you have it, folks. So, yeah, if you want to go skydiving, Contact D Zone here in Coeur d'Alene, they'll take you up. Uh, you got people flying in from Cleveland to jump here. I'd like to know more about that, but they didn't seem interested in being on camera, so. They're being kind of smarty alecky. Appreciate smart ness You know, I should have been hanging out over here a long time ago. A little conversation going. Problemas. You guys call in if you're interested. See if they call 911. See, I never do that. I'm busy. But I bet you sometimes they call 911 and they say, What's your emergency? And they say, This guy out there with a the camera. 
and they say, is he committing a crime? He ain't got my permission. 